So we've got this brand spanking new Mercedes EQC 400, formatic, meaning it's four wheel drive, but uh, as also electric. See the little green bit that tells you it's electric. Um, when I say brand spanking new, what I mean is he hasn't cleaned it from new, so it does look dirty. So you wouldn't think it'd be delivered like that. But we've asked him not to clean it until he can get it here, so that, that we, he doesn't cause any scratches. I'm going to do a touchless wash. Uh, meaning that I don't touch it, at, certainly at the start, we will have to touch it at some point. <laughs> um, so I'm going to jet wash it with a soap that's going to break down whatever wax might have been put on by the dealer. Um, the soap that they use, while I'm still on the subject, some of this strong stuff can mark these this trim. And we see many, many Mercedes with these trims really badly marked. You know, sort of, if you're looking at it now, you see all these marks on it. That's because they used to wash the wheels with it and put the stuff on the wheels and now they spray the whole bloody car. So um, the stuff we use won't mark the rims by the way, the trim, but it will take off the wax. Um, and then we're going to put a graphene coating <laughs> on it. Um, and um, that's going to then make it stay glossy. You'll clean it about half the amount of times. It'll have less scratches on it and it will be wonderful to, wonderful to live with. Enough of that. We're going to get it clean now, so the next video will be an in-progress video showing you what it looks like when it's half done. <laughs> and then it's the final video you're all looking out for, isn't it? <laughs> the one where it's done. <laughs> right, so just a quick update. Um, the car's now perfectly clean, uh, which has taken some doing, but um, it is now clean. So the wheels are cleaned in every little tiny hole right in there if you look carefully you'll see they're absolutely ready for the coating they've been cleaned with alcohol as well so they that uh, creates the bonding surface right so all good gonna sit down and spend god knows how long doing these wheels i've never seen a set of wheels like that before so um yeah okay we've been both going at it so now it looks like a mirror so what we like to do is get it so that it looks like it's got the coating on it before we put the coating on it that makes sense and this actually looks like it's got the coating on it at the moment because we've buffed it and and cleaned it all with alcohol the wheels are coated we've got to do the vinyl which we'll do tomorrow and it's already like a crisp brand spanking new car the scratches here are you well, blind man would be that pleased to be able to see that. And it took some work to get it here, but it is here. It's looking fantastic, Billis. Um, so uh, there's not a dot or dirt anywhere on it, nothing at all, just perfect, like a mirror. So we're going to coat it first thing in the morning. We'll both be here at 8 o'clock and uh, we'll get the coating on it. So the wheels are coated, that's a big thing. They took forever to go those wheels. Um, but yes, there you go. J James has prepared the whole car while I've done the wheels. Is that right? <laughs> That's without the cleaning of them. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, there you go. The wheels are a complex design, shall we say. So, there you go. Uh, so far, so good. Right, so there it is, looking an absolute million dollars. Why wouldn't it be? So the car will do self-cleaning, um, meaning that it doesn't clean itself indefinitely. You do have to wash it and you have to wash it properly now as well because it's got the coating on it. It will punish you if you just give it a quick one. And in the summertime, you want to look in the bling factor. Then, of course, you might spend a bit longer. You clean it because it's now like glass. So the, the glass is like glass. Now the body's like glass. If that makes sense. The wheels have got the coating in. Can you imagine the intricate bits of what's done on those bloody wheels so don't if you've got one of these and they've got those wheels on can you just go somewhere else <laughs> or no i'm only joking just we don't we, the wheels are double <laughs> uh, but otherwise you know the car looks absolutely wonderful we've done the glass you can't really see the stuff on the glass but that means that you get the self-cleaning on the glass and if it's pouring with rain 
the glass throws the water off. It's handy if you're coming up to a roundabout and it's throwing it down because you can see out the side windows, whereas otherwise your windows might be smothered in water, whereas this does the self-cleaning, you know, it throws the water off. A bit like Rain-X, but it's, it lasts a lot longer. Also, it makes it, if it's just below zero, uh, it doesn't ice up. You know, everyone else is ice up, you get in your car and drive off. Brilliant, I've done it loads of times. So, but the main benefit is, of course, the panoramic vision when it's raining. But anyway, I've done about three laps of it. You've seen enough. It's absolutely wonderful. He's very impressed with it. Why wouldn't he be? He's going to look fantastic. So he can drive it down to the beach now and show off. Why not? Drive it to the seaside. Amazing. <laughs>